Welcome to another episode of Carbs, the only show where I sit in the car and BS while consuming carbs. Mad Zion here. We are going to be reviewing something from our good buddy over at California Blazing Chili Farms. You can go ahead and check out his uh, store down below. There's a link to where you can buy all of his products. He sent us this Blazing Venom Deadly Inferno Trinidad Scorpion Barbecue Sauce. I, I just have a lot of things that he sent, so I am going to uh, dive right on into this, this thing. His stuff's usually really hot, but very enjoyable. I already got some on my finger here, so let's just try a little. Oh, Jesus. Oh, my God. Oh, oh no. Oh, no. All right, well, I don't think I was ready for this level of intense pain, but there we go. We got some on our spoon there. Make sure to put the cap on this, just in case I start to flail wildly. The last thing I would want is Carolina Reaper barbecue sauce all over my car. So like I said, thank you to him for uh, giving us just all kinds of good stuff. Really good, good guy and great products overall. Make sure to check out his store down below. Let's suffer, baby. Here we go. Oh. 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 It's got great barbecue sauce flavor. Oh. It's not unbearably hot. That's why I did this. I figured it wouldn't be, but it's, it's got a really, really strong initial kick. Back of the throat burn, back of the tongue. Oh man, it's tasty, but like a lot of his stuff, I don't know if I could actually put that on anything and enjoy what I was eating because, oh man, salivating. It's going to make my, my nose run like crazy. Oh it is an experience when you try a lot of his products. I still think the my favorite thing that we've ever tried from him is his candied bacon. That stuff was spectacular, but it was so hot at the same time. I'm surprised this isn't giving me hiccups because I think it's at the heat level where it might. I can feel it down in here. Maybe they'll pop up eventually, but mm, good overall flavor. You definitely get the heat of the pepper and the flavor of the pepper mixed in with the barbecue sauce. It's very tasty, and now it's wearing off. Maybe I could put that on something, but I'm just not so sure. I would rate that a, a very low four out of five. I'm gonna try to put it on something. I'm gonna take it home and when Lori makes some dinner, I'm gonna try to put it on something and see if maybe interacting with food would help kill the heat a little bit, cause damn, that is hot. There are so many buses that go by this street. Every single video I filmed has been a bus. But there you go, guys. Thank you so much for watching. What are your thoughts on this? Oh God. Ooh, and what is a barbecue sauce that you love to put on something? What's your favorite barbecue sauce? Let me know in the comments down below, and we'll see you on the next episode.